Every culture has their, their hero mythology. Ours just happens to be the American West, in my mind, the, the, the hero, the cowboy, the, the James Dean, you know, or the, the John Wayne. I'm interested in uh, the concept of nostalgia and inherited history, and my most recent work has been focused on more Western, or the mystique of the West. Colorado, where I grew up in a tiny mountain town, there was nothing to do in the winter times other than watch movies. So I spent a lot of time watching all these old films, and I feel like it 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 just stained my subconscious from a very early point in my life, and it kind of bubbled back up to the surface years later. I was trying to find those raw moments of these very polished icons. So I was really interested in uh, grabbing film stills and um, like random continuity shots from old movies and finding kind of that blurry moment that's not quite reality but not quite the finished, you know, colored, beautiful, packaged movie that people saw on the big screen. When SIF approached me about doing the Golden Space Needle Award, they originally said that there was no design constraints and just, we want to see what you can come up with. But considering that the thing that I'd been commissioned to make is actually called the Golden Space Needle Award, you know, it's kind of like full circle. It's like, well, it kind of has to acknowledge, you know, the most iconographic building in Seattle. So I think that's where it started. And then I wanted to change, kind of turn it on its head. I knew it had to be something very elongated and elegant and, you know, roughly mimicking the silhouette of the Space Needle, but I try to stop it there. Something that I think is kind of cool about the festival here is that it's not glitzy. It's not about the celebrity factor of filmmaking. It's about you go to the film festival if you really love movies. So when I was considering the material appropriateness of what to use for making the sculpture, I wanted something that was um, utilitarian. So immediately I was thinking of steel forms. And uh, the base of the work is actually angle iron, which is super utilitarian. The silhouette of the camera lens itself, really beautiful. It's these beautiful little delicate nuanced circles. And I love the idea of a circle because I think that conveys the idea of telling a story. It can't be just a beautiful, shiny object. It has to have relevance, it has to have weight and, and a, a sense of uh, intentional construct. I mean, it's, it's not a flashy material and it's not a flashy film festival. It's really about the content and the, the connection with the other makers of stories. Mm -hmm.